UFC light heavyweight contender Johnny Walker leaked the video message to his supporter after his loss with Jamal Hill at UFC Vegas 48. What's up guys? I'm okay. Just a little cut here. I sleep in the fight. So something happened wrong. Proper 12. <laughs> with my coach, my manager. Now a lot of pizza. And okay. Let's eat and be happy and let's go to the next one. Another combat sport news is from Bare Knuckle Fighting Championship. BKFC Knuckle Mania 2 took a place in Hard Rock Hotel and Casino in Hollywood. Mike Perry and Julian Lane faced off in 5 round ultimate main event. With all three scoring, with total score 48 and 46, Mike Perry get victory over Julian Lane. Platinum Mike Perry tweets, Thank you everyone who came out Bare Knuckle FC. Thank you to all the fighter I met this week. I got my feet wet. You all are soldier. Let's enjoy this time off with our families and get back to the training. What we do in life equals in eternity. UFC President Dana White is real foodie. Once he said in an interview, the real reason I work out is I love to eat food. Every Friday, he tried to cook some new dish. This Friday, he cooked deep fried burger. What's up everybody, it's fucking Friday here at UFC headquarters and today we are doing the fried In-N-Out Burger. Most of you on the East Coast have never had the opportunity to try In-N-Out Burger. It is one of the best burgers you can ever get as far as fast food goes. And today, we're gonna fry it and eat it. Start off with a double-double from In-N-Out Burger, cover it in batter, and fry it at 350 degrees until it's golden. Here we go. Hot. I mean, it's really good. You, you can't you can't mess up an In-N-Out Burger, but uh, let me tell you, it doesn't it doesn't suck. It, it, it's it's pretty good. I think if you like In-N-Out Burger, give it a shot and see if you like it. Last week at UFC 271, Michael Bisping accused of biased commentary. But this week, Michael Bisping posted a workout video where he is hitting heavy bag. Check out the video. Another latest MMA update is from Bellator 274. In the welterweight bout, Andre Koreskov get victory against Chance Ren Country by spinning kick. But this spinning kick from Russian Koreskov did some severe damage, which create 5 broken ribs, a puncture in lung and bruises in the kidney. I mean man, hats up to those fighters who puts their life on the risk to entertain us. Former UFC women bantamweight champion Amanda Nunez says that losing the fight with Juliana Penn has brought her fire back. In the recent media talk, she says, Honestly, after I lose the belt, the fire is like built up again. I'm telling you, damn, I can't wait to start over. I have something to chase. It's not like, oh my god, I lost the belt. And staying home crying. That's never gonna happen with me. Actually, UFC changed my life. How I living, whatever happened right now, is like amazing. UFC changed literally my life. I don't have time to be sad.